have a reggae in my life. Yeah, so all the, all the album. Contraband. 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 It's, Contraband. it's still a go there. It's still a go there. Reception great on the tour and, mm-hmm. and everything are going good. Reggae music was a song where really, where really jump out. For the people there. Yeah, yeah, because it's a song where when we, when we do the album still, you know, it's like we expectation what for the song with all, with the and Contraband. So that's what I did the big one. And but I want to know why everybody, really, why everybody feels if them do a tune with, 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 with Damien, that's going to be the biggest song. <laughs> it's a kind of illusion that you're not living in our No, and I even the, just the facts say, uh, uh, Damien. But the song itself, everybody did love the song. No, but everybody you know, love the song. But I mean, right now, everybody feels if them do a tune with, with gang. Is that, that song they're gonna uh, that song they're gonna big which me like the tune, I'm me like that. the tune about um what the one where you talk with the sister them? Natural woman. Natural woman. Me love natural woman man. Yeah man, can go on good. Me love, love natural video woman. Video and mm-hmm. Well I'm all right I know me don't know if I shoot five more videos from the album, but <laughs> sometimes people need new music, yeah. yeah. I'm afraid that the album thing is telling them out because I feel like if me did promote all of them songs in our singles, mm-hmm. we would probably have 10 big songs in other people in mind, as opposed to the album and you know, say, yeah. you know, the real fans them have them favorites and things, but everybody now have a new certain song. Mm-hmm. You know? Mm-hmm. But I the, one of the, the album thing really, it, it really helps to put it on a different level as an artist. But I always tell artists, don't rush to put out album, build up your platform first, yeah. build up a fan base. Yeah, yeah. Everybody I rush for the album. The first thing I hear about the artist is the album. I'm a don't know who the artist is. You know, first time, some, first time, yeah. usually album is you, you, you big it, then you put on that one album. You know, nowadays you people put pure new tune per album. Pure new tune. Is that yeah. different thing now? Yeah. Normally, when once you get a hit now, you know, say you're in the running to, to do an album. Album, yeah, yeah, yeah. You put some songs around it and thing, but yeah, nowadays a pure, pure new song per album. Everybody has studio now. And yeah. Everybody has producer and things. So, you so, can just make music. So, let me ask you something now. Because I listen to the album. Me, you have a philosophy. I know I can't hold you for philosophy. Because I like you. You know, I like your philosophy. I hold you for ways. And I'm not really in love, man. Me, here you have one point where I say, see the Peter Dash thing there for the TV there. Yeah. Where, where I say, um, about life after death. Yeah, reincarnation. Yeah, where you are saying, oh, you know, if if this if um, if life not there after death, what do you use at this and what do you use at that? Sure. All right. So, oh, 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 you come to that philosophy, then? Oh. Well, just different things I read and, and different experiences I may have, and just you know, matching it out with my common sense. Because even in the song, in the chorus, I say, what is the meaning of life? If you only have one chance to live and some die as a kid, you know, if if I look at you live, some some babies dead, you know, right after childbirth, some. Mm-hmm four or five years old, some ten years old, if that are them only chance to experience the earth, mm. then it not seem fair to me. Okay. You know, as some people live all some life for them all in a corruption and all kind of thing mm. and still live till them are seventy, eighty. Mm. You know, if if them no if if them not get some kind of retribution in a in a whether in a the afterlife or in a next life, then it coming like it never makes sense to me. No, it's one don't make sense. Child. One don't make yeah. sense. The life, yes or no, or the life. What, 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 what you say don't make sense? No, it wouldn't make sense to me if there is no, there is no life. continuation after. So what would happen now after, after, all right, for instance, a murderer. A yeah. murderer dead. And him never, him never PFA where him do. Yeah. When him dead now, what is going to happen that cause him to pay for that? Well, various things are going to happen. Yeah. Basically, so once, you, once you're dead, mm. once your, 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 your spirit get disconnected from your flesh, your body, you go through a process where you run through the entire life that you experience. And that, whatever, from the, from the moment you're dead, goes straight back to your birth. Mm. And all your experiences basically get weighed up. Even in a, in a Kemet, mm. you know, you talk about the weighing of the heart and the feather. You know, with my heart. 
that is basically the, the judgment scene that happened after everybody died. All right. Basically, so, yeah. So who come, who experienced that, what you say, if you explain that? Well, everybody experienced it at least once still, but it's the memory of it. So you have different ones who, different ones who, you know, call them initiates, or different ones who, you know, evolve past a certain level, them can maintain a memory of it, mm. you know, you know, in the afterlife. And there's ways to even communicate with, with spirits who are not in the physical, and them can tell you what's happening and, and how that experience is go. And you have books, you have a book named Journey of Souls, where yeah. he's a psychiatrist who, he never believed in none of them things. Like me. Matter of fact, it's two books. <laughs> like it's me. two books I can reference. Yeah. What's that? No, I say like me. Yeah, see, all right, see there. So now him, basically, he would have patients who have traumatic experience. So mm -hmm. he would have hypnotized them and regressed them to, to, to bring up them past That's experience. Like, yeah. And then after a while, he noticed this one patient, then kept going back further and further because he couldn't find the root of the problem. Mm. Then the patient started describing a completely different life mm. while he's under the hypnosis, you know, yeah. and start describing a totally different, you know, where he's living, community, family members and things. Mm. And then he gets to find out, say, it's a different yeah. life, the man I, 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 yeah. I talk about. Yeah, you have only you know, one. Details about it, you know, details yeah. where them actually go research yeah. the, the history of that area and, and find out that true matter lived there yeah. and, and so and so and then he start to do that with various amount of patients till him to thousands of patients yeah. and then he start to record them and that's when write the book so you have one name many lives many masters where the, the psychiatrist mainly focus on the past lives the different lives and, and it's a thing where once the people then bring up the scenarios from them past life, like somebody might have get shot in them chest, and then them, them, the pain where they must experience in them, in them current life in them chest, mm. it go away once them go through the, the healing of bringing up that. And mm. people with injuries in them leg is because them leg did get broken in a past life or all kind of different things, and them carry the trauma. Mm. And then them things they get healed, that's why them start to believe and them come to write a book then. But then the journey of souls now, a different me, me know about that book there. Me know about that book there. Me know about that book there. Journey of Souls. Yeah. Trust me. Yeah, you don't want to read them books. No, know. me know about the book. Me never read half the whole light, but me know, I mean, okay. know of the book. But me can ask you something now, because there's a lot of reasoning round, surrounding that. And even in a Buddhism, them tell you about yes. reincarnation, that you go on and go on, and it's like inside you can't come back as a fly, you can't come back as a dog. Or well, I don't subscribe to that. Uh, that is a that is Why you know the whole the whole purpose of reincarnation is evolving and we pass the animal stage already. All of us so, so, just so dog no experience the animal stage thousands so, of years, millions of years ago. So uh, dog no experience, dog no experience where you are talking about then. Dog, a dog, dog life, a life. It's life, you know. I don't think you have separate life more than the manifestation of the life. So when I say if dog experience that in our next life well the thing about dogs is see domesticated animals mm. the reason why them come amongst humans is because them want the thing about animals animals don't have individual souls like how we have animals are oh you know that oh you know that just things on the read no things I'm not come to accept i can't tell you it's facts okay okay but just okay, things on the read and okay. come to accept and i don't yeah. believe me just accept yeah and it because it makes sense because an animal, an animal can't really, an animal can't, all right, what, how, how, the, how the animal thing works. It's a species of animal. Mm. Basically, each individual animal experience, after that animal die, then they, they, it goes back into a pool, where they call the group soul. Just like how we, our experience is an individual soul, so everything we learn in this life, we process it, and then it determine our next life. Everything animals do, mm. it determine the whole species. That's why when you teach a certain amount of monkeys how to do certain things, mm. and you pass a certain amount, then the whole species learn to do it in different parts. Yeah, but me not talk about, no, if you domesticate the animal, you know, me just ask. Yeah, no, me I get to the domesticate. Normally, so if an animal, if a dog, or a cat, yeah. or a ants, if them have a next life, 
No, what, there's, what, the, what, what I've read mm. is that you have different stages of animals, different stages. You see, when, when well, that, that's how I get into some holy thing with evolution, mm. but... No, 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 wrong with evolution, no, no, wrong with evolution. The animals that are at the pioneers, the, mm. the most advanced animals are like the dogs, the cats, the horses, the ones that become domesticated. And those, those, and in terms of land animals, those are the most advanced intellectually and everything and them animals come amongst humans because they want to learn from us they are animals are human beings take individuals. them really are maybe it's humans take them out and in the habitat and, and bring them amongst man it's not them come amongst humans it's, it's well, human take them and bring them into for them and in a, a habitat i don't know have no animal where yeah because choose yeah, because to come amongst human beings it's, it's, it's just like the, the quote-unquote angels them you know they are ahead of us you know they are more advanced and also they help us. That's why some ones want to become connected with them. And that is why we worship them and we, 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 we do rituals to them because we want to get to know them and we want to be no, like no, them. We, no, 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 so we, no, 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 so we, no, 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 so we, no, 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 not, not, not you or I, no, I'm just yeah. talking generally as humans. You know, the, 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 the majority of humans look to, look to deities and all of these kind of yeah. beings. It's just like how animals look to we. No, wait, yes, no, wait, yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, me, yes, me yes, ask yes, you. I don't want to prolong the reason that we are there, but I can ask you a question now. Yes. Dogs go to heaven? <laughs> Where if, like, if, if no, we, you know, if we... Dogs can't go to heaven. Dogs can't, can't go to heaven. heaven. But human beings go. Human beings go to heaven. So, if, so wait, no, so that means, you know, heaven, heaven in heaven, defined. eh? We have to define heaven. We have to define heaven. Well, heaven is not where we they know, or hell is not where we they know, according to our religion perspective of heaven and hell. My heaven, my heaven is really when me feel good and me have my food and thing, and me and my wife is okay with one another, and my friend them and thing. Me say that is heaven. Yeah. Hell is low like all today. <laughs> when we can't move in the traffic. <laughs> well, that is that's a symbolic way of looking at it, but I can give you yeah. a more literal view where, uh, yeah, where okay. we kind of correlate to what you are saying. Yeah. Basically, heaven and hell exist within the same space that 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 physical reality exists, sure. but it's just on a different plane of existence. Yeah. So just like how you have solid, liquid, and gas, mm. gases operate within the same area as solids and liquids, but them in a different density. So it's just like you have ether, which which our etheric body basically is a is a higher density part to our physical body. And that's the blueprint of our physical body. When when somebody amputate them leg and them still feel the pain in the area where the the amputated part is gone, that's mm. because them etheric leg is still there and it don't disintegrate as yet. Yeah. So 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 that is that is one stage. Then you have the astral. Now when them talk about people and you can people see them aura and them see different colors in them aura, that's usually the astral body. That is your body of your emotions and your feelings and, and them kind of sensations. And then you have a mental body, which is even a, a higher density part, but it all interpenetrates our physical but it extends further. So basically when we when we drop flesh we got to an existence where we, we're existing in our etheric body and then that disintegrate. Then we go through a process where them called purgatory where you where you're living in your astral body. And then now that is where you have the hell or the heaven like experiences based on what you did in your life. Yeah. If they did bear bad things in your life, you have to have a hellish experience mm. in that astral body. That is a and that is a that is, and then that is after that, no, you yeah. drop the astral body and then you're in your inner, your mental body, and that is what you call they call the second heaven. Yeah, intellectualize a Christian concept. Cause it's really a Christian concept you're talking about. No, it's not a Christian concept uh, still in Well, it's, it's, a, it's concept a concept that, alright, it's a concept of Christian have Christian it. it. Alright, what, what may I say? It's universal. Yeah, no, it's not universal. Trust me, it's not universal. It's not yeah, universal. Man, different every, different yeah, cultures. That's it's why like I ask you. If, in, a, in, a, in a ancient Kemet from them times. No, you know, but we, no, that's why I ask you if dog. No, I ask, that's why I ask if dog is in heaven, you know. Because you have separate life now. So you, have, you have separate human life from dog life, from cow life, 
when really you know what you're saying now is that it's, it's the body that make the difference you know it's not the life that make the difference it's what is where the life exists at a given time that make the difference so the life of the dog and the life of the cow and the life of the goat and the life of man is one life and it's different manifestation of that life which is the flesh now where it manifests it so where i would have really say without read about it is that the life where we are where we are talking about can exist i mean can can perceive where we are called heaven or hell, heaven or earth, without the body. No, and the body. No, that's why I have to disagree. No, me know because you have to disagree we, because we you don't take. So no, because you said the concept already. Of the physical. No, because but you say. Conscious, you you, you take body, you take body. life, you take life as an individual thing rather than as and a, and, and, and a sum total of, of, of one thing. No, it's, no, no, not necessarily. Yeah, because you say my life and your life. It means say you mm-hmm. differentiate life. No, I never say anything about my life and your life. I'm not saying we, as human beings, yeah. our consciousness is focused in, in our physical bodies through our brains. Yeah, but it can't so, work without the brains. What's that? It can't work without the brains. No, it can't work in the physical without our brain. That's no, it can't work. Brain, nothing can't existence. work without the brain. It can't work without the brain. So, human you being, being, if you do have no brain, you can't. There is no life. No, if you do have no brain, yes, if you do have no brain, you don't have no life. So you can't no, say, no, no, you no, can't no. say your life. So, crazy. so, so you only have life for, 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 for a maximum of 100, 120 years. That's just Muta life. Muta li- of life. Yeah, muta life exists for 120 years. But after muta gone, life still exists. But not muta life. No, no, no. But that, I mean. That because you can't person, individualize I'm life. You, I can't, can't. you can't individualize life. So when if muta if muta flesh dead, if muta gone, the life that exists is not muta. It's life. No, it's just your body dropping in and you still have yeah, life. But it's not muta when life. You, when you're sleeping and you're dreaming and you leave your body, you know. It's the same thing, you know, but your life is No, it, it's not the same thing. It's not the same thing. Because you can't jump yeah, out of that. You can't that jump out of your body. You can't jump out of that. Your physical body and your eat and your astral together. No, but you can't jump out of that. You can travel all around the planet and come back to your body. Come back you, you can't jump out of that. If you yep. pass, it just means that you don't have access to the physical world because you don't have a physical body. That, that means that you are individualized life. Because that means that you are individualized life. But we have to. We, we are humans. No, we have individual souls. Because you're in a body. Life no, it's because you're in an individual body. Why you're individual life? If you do have the yeah, body, the life is not. You are saying that muta is life. No, no, yeah, I am. No, no, I am. No, yeah, because I am in the body. That's why I say muta life. If muta don't yeah, exist, exactly. muta life don't exist. It's life exists. No, life exists. Yeah, so, so it's not we muta all, life. We're all coming, our, our souls are all made from the same source. But, but once you reach the human stage... It's a different thing. So it's, it's the manifestation of the life that make it different. It's not the life make it different. It's the manifestation of the life in the flesh that no, make it different. Sure. Sure. So sure. when, so that, when that, the flesh... Yeah, so I'm asking now, when the flesh gone, mm-hmm. there is no more muta. No, muta. there is just life. That is that is just not true. All right. Well, it's not true. You that mean it's not what you believe? You not can what communicate with their ancestors, with their, I, their family members, them who have passed. I don't know about that. that, that I don't know about that. Do. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I Bridget. can carry it to somebody right now who don't know anything about your family, and them can call upon your ancestors. I, I can. I can carry it to a whole heap of people who can do that. Only you would know. But I can carry it to a whole heap of people who do that. Of course. I can't carry so, to people so, in a California. I can't carry to people so in where Africa. Where do you think I'm getting information from? I am saying to you, that's why I ask you, if a dog go to heaven. Oh, and if a, a dog go to thing, heaven. Muta. These things are very technical, you know. Because no, it's not technical, man. A group soul. And the group soul of the dog exists in heaven. It exists on the heavenly plane. But the dog itself, like how you are talking about, or you say muta, would, would cease to exist. It's the same way the dog, the individual dog, wouldn't exist as an individual in the heaven plane. It exists as a group soul. So there's no flesh in heaven then? No flesh. It is, is a, is a, is, is, 
you could technically call it flesh, but it's not like physical, dense flesh like what we see in here. But to, but to, but to the person who is in heaven, the, the, what they are seeing or what they are experiencing is just as real as what we are experiencing here. Matter of fact, a, a, a one can can be existing in heaven without their physical body, and they're still seeing everything. All right, so, so the murderer, so the murderer, the astral, they're seeing the astral counterpart. All right, so I can tell you, I ask you, the murderer. Mm -hmm. If a man murder somebody, and if a man do good, the man who do good, make what say, the man who do good, pan right now when he's alive, yeah, and the man who murder when he's alive, that. That spirit, if we could, we could call it spirit, that life force, mm -hmm. that energy, where it meet? Where it meet? Yeah, where it meet to decide that you was the murderer and you was the good man? No, but that, 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 that as I said, after the, 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 the soul leaves the body, all the experience, you know when people say a life flash before you? That's a process that happened where it's being etched into your astral body, all your life experiences. And those life experiences mm. reshape your astral body based on how good or bad those experiences were. And then you begin a process in the afterlife of going through those events. And if you cause this person harm, you will experience back that harm. And that's why people would say if you do bad things, it feels like hell because it's a hellish experience. Calm you, have a, you have to experience back all of those negative things that you have did and all the positive things you did for people. You have to feel the blessing and all the positivity come back to you. And it actually takes up, it's a process that takes time. And then that once you once you complete that, then you can rest in what they call the higher heaven plane. And that is when you start, can start communicating with other beings and planning your next life. That's why and I then you ask have, you. you have, That's you why guides, I ask you. You have spirit guides who are there with you. And then they start to help you to plan your next life and, and determine which family, which country you are going to be in. We are in Kemet. We are in Kemet that happened. So far now, which fear and which... Um, which one are the people them who them put in those pyramids? That mm -hmm. experience where you're talking about? Well, if you check the pyramid text, then talk about the whole afterlife process. No, me know what them talk about what them talk about. Me say, which one no, are them the show you them depicted. Remember, say, we don't have people's physical work to go after. We just have, we cannot look on the, the hieroglyphs and we can see the depictions of the afterlife scenes. All of them things they depicted out. No, I never say them don't depict out, you know, because you see you have people who make iPhone now and can show you how the iPhone work. I have yeah. said to you now, these things on the wall, the, on the wall, the hieroglyphics on the wall, mm -hmm. that these men believe is happening. That's why them put all the people them who them love in the coffin with them. So yeah. them kill them dog, them kill the, anything, them wife, them kill them servants. All of them people that go in the, the, the grave with them. So I'm saying now, because them believe that there is an afterlife, mm -hmm. them do all of these things. So them belief is on the wall, you know. It's not something that them experience and come back and then put it on the wall, you know. It's them belief them put on no, the wall. You know, it couldn't do that. Yeah, so if them belief is on the wall, mm -hmm. right? It's not them experience them put on the wall, you know. It's them belief. So I am saying, yeah, you know, what, you know what, the, what is their belief shaped off of? Them belief is shaped off of them belief. Just like one man believes that Jesus Christ is a condom. Of other people hearing about these experiences. Mm, them belief is based up of what another person tell them. Like an elder will exactly. tell them this and that. But the elder don't much have to experience it, you know. It's like when mm -hmm. Moses go in at the tabernacle and say, just say the Lord. Mm -hmm. The Lord no most of it is said nothing to him, you know. It's where him come up, come gather in him consciousness. Him come tell the people them. Mm -hmm. Like when him go up to the mountain and the burning bush and him say, Alright, come down. Just say the Lord, let my people go. It no mean say to really and truly somebody up in the mountain and tell him someone let go of the people them, you know. It's where him believe can suffice him as an individual for come now, for come free the people them. So most of these things on the walls of the, the hieroglyphics is not something, the man who did write it never experienced that, you know. It's something where he believe. It's like the first man who got a doctorate. He, he wasn't really a doctor, you know, but he come, come get a doctorate. So, so, I said, so, so the that's, people them in the book, when them when them on the hypnosis and they're not even conscious and then telling you about experiences that they have had, is that what they believe? 
if what them believe I don't know yeah, what is happening exactly to them. I don't know what them. But people are not even conscious, you know. No, but I don't know what is happening to them, you know. I don't know well, what is happening to them. Because let me not read about it. Me read about it all the while. Me, me, me I sit to you. No, so I'm asking you. If I, you, if I you don't. Think that's a belief thing, no, or, I, or is it an experience thing? No, I don't think it's an experience. I don't think it's an experience. So it's an illusion. Maybe, maybe. Okay, and if not an illusion, then what? Eh? If it's not an illusion, then what? Can you say maybe? Yeah, because I don't know. I don't know. I can't say it's an illusion. I don't know. It being an experience. No, I am trying it to show you. No, here we know. I am saying to you. No, it can't be an experience. No, it can't be an okay. experience. It can't okay. be an experience. And I am saying now, within the level of the country, if that is the case, why are we ruling out the other species that was before we uh, in a, all of this manifestation of what we're talking about, why we, why we exclude all of these things? Man is no, the animals are not before us. Well, the animals are not. We have been, we have been on our. We are the animals are different life ways than us. They will animals them was on the earth before human beings. Yeah, and this physical manifestation. They're not physical. Then animal not physical. No, but a physical. No, I don't know about that region. I tell you, the animals was on the earth. Before man, and if animals and human beings is on it, why is it that human beings is coming now to say, Well, we have this and that and that, but we don't know about the animal them? So I ask you, is cow, goat, lion, tiger, zebra, all of these things, if these things is caught in those spiritual consciousness that we're talking about? Most uh, of the time when I hear remember, people talk, they exclude them. Basically, life is to exist on an individual level eh? after the, after the, after you drop flesh. So why why would you assume that an animal is any different? I never assume animal is different. It's you are say animal not there. You say animal is on a next other plane. No, I am telling you, sir. Exist in the state that they exist. We our existence continues. Mm in a very similar way after we drop flesh after animal drop flesh its existence is completely different oh you know it that no oh you know that experience but oh you know that, that. What, what oh you, you know are that saying about humans that's what happens to animals what i say about human oh you know you that that's what that, i'm you asking say that to exist after no, you but oh, you know, Kabaka. Oh, oh, you know, say, oh, oh, you, you know, know, say, animal. animal don't exist like all the human being exist. Oh, you know that. It's just based on what I read and what I come no, to no. because it makes yeah. sense. To me. All right. So, uh, well, all right, all right. We're not, we're not saying nothing. It makes sense to I you. I think I think human beings show a much greater propensity to 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 grow and evolve over different. Generation, but is this so the an, but is this so the you but is this when no human being never left on earth animal did there millions of years before the man the human being? So, why but is it no the development of the human is on a much different level due to it, intelligence? Of course, it's a different level because them working inside a flesh that is different, of course. Yes, so and why is that? The thing about it is, you know, consciousness chooses the body so that it can develop some kind of faculty, you know. And every animal is a representation. That's why in Egypt, all of the animals were used to symbolize different things. It's the character of the animal them symbolize. Them character is the symbolize is the character of the animal that them symbolizing in human being. Like when a man say, woman say man a dog. You know, really say mm -hmm. the man is dog. It's a certain character, certain exactly. Beer. So when I say and, the, and uh, human beings have all those characters. Animals <laughs> have a certain amount, like like a dog. It's yeah. really all about the nose and smell. That is what, that is what. It has of the course. That the animal perfect. That's why I'm no, asking you again. It has again. sharper senses than we in terms of smell. But it don't have the sight where we have. It don't have certain things Of course. Have. Just like how we have things where the dog don't have. The dog don't have things where we don't have. Let's the lion have things where the dog don't have. The dog don't have things where the lion have. I am saying exactly. to you. Who is it's man? About it is, you know, once, it, once you start to develop the brain on a certain level, certain faculties start to um, disintegrate, you know. It's just like back in the day when human beings were less developed in the brain, they had more spiritual ability. They could see the other worlds. That's how they were able to communicate with these different beings. And you see angels come and visit people because they were less evolved brain and intellectually. They had more spiritual capabilities. I know about... I 
I think we was more spiritual, but I don't know about no other beings. I don't know about no other beings because I know, say, within the consciousness, there's no, all right, in, in a my thinking, not reading, in a my thinking, there's no way earth could have exist like this with so much different life forms and life forces. Mm -hmm. And we who develop from these life forces and life forms come tell me now, say, what we experience after death. Mm -hmm. These animals don't experience it after death. Or if them don't experience it after they're death. They're going to, they're going to evolve and they're going to experience it later on, but currently they don't. So they evolve to what? You mean all animals going to evolve to human beings? The current, what is the current life wave that we've seen as plants now? Yeah. In the future, they're going to manifest as animals in another incarnation. Of I don't, and then I, can't, that, I, can't that. I can't go with that. I can't go with that. I can't go with that, Virgin. It's just a progression. Who no, but I evolution. cannot go with that. Evolution means uh, the, the, the plant physically not the plant the animal physically move from one level to the next level in this life no not in this life All in right. terms of this uh, animal might have 20 years to live no these things happen over millions and billions of years yeah well, well billions and trillions of years yes but it's in this life not in the next life in this life not in the next I, life i'm not sure anyone is in this life all right for instance if if we talk about evolution mm -hmm over up millions of years fish manifest um ape manifest walk straight stand up human beings if you are dealing with evolution mm -hmm. that is not that is in this life mm -hmm. in other words the fish don't dead and then a next fish come without the connection of that fish and then manifest from earth and then now become ape and then that ape dead and uh, you totally have no connection with that and it no, come that does, no that doesn't happen sure. yeah so what we are talking about is that the continuity of life the one source will start all of this mm -hmm. in my thinking there's no way that i could uh, express a different between the lion, the elephant, the tiger, and all these things. And then now say, my experience is upon a higher level than the puppy. Because after we don't domesticate the puppy, the puppy now going to start work according to we but if you never have the puppy in the house the puppy would have work work out everything him work out everything him never have to go to doctor me see my dog go out sick and go out there and yam some bush and me I say oh man yam them kind of bush there and he's, him, him know what kind of bush him smell the bush and know say that bush the good for something Right? Yeah, because the animals, them born with instinct, but what you teach them is, is on a different level than them instinct. I know. It's, yeah, what you teach them is to become how you want them to be, which is yeah. almost like a, a slavery. You, you want them to be what you want them to be. No human being want nobody to be what they want them to be. You call that slavery. So no, we, but for animals, for the animals, they want they want somebody to love. Like domesticated animals is different from wild animals. Yeah, but they the animals want, want somebody that they can show affection. Because you train them that way. No, no, that's a natural thing for a dog. Look here, dog was growing in, in wolves. Wolves was running up and down all over the place without the heel of man, love and kindness. And a matter yes. of fact, wolves use only a man because them feel the man is always trying to kill them. Yes, but that's why the dog man bite. don't kill them. What happened? What did that man do? Kill? The man. When him done, don't kill who? If, if the man don't kill the dog, yes, the dog will grow to love the man. So all oh, the, oh, the lion don't love him same way, and the elephant don't love him same way, and the alligator because don't love him same way. Not as advanced as the dog. No, you can't say that. Oh, you ever say that? <laughs> you mean a human being? I say that. A human being said the lion not advanced as a dog. It's a human no, being. Not, that's a, there are ways to quantify the difference. You know why you say you know you, you know why you say the animal is the dog more 
No, but there's but, a reason why 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 police train dogs for the certain thing and they yeah. don't train lions for the certain thing. No, because they him don't have, have access to, to no certain no, certain no him do have access to lions because him, you can yeah, train the lion so you can train the elephant. To lion. You, you, you never see people train elephant. Yeah, elephant is another one. Where and him don't miss it. No, but but you are you are saying no. Because a, pro, a dog is if a domesticate an animal, he is a higher intelligence than the lion who don't is it All right. Or an like alligator. A can't do the same things that an elephant can do when it comes to memory and intelligence. Yeah, but an elephant... It, it don't, don't manifest like that. But a rhinoceros can do things where the elephant can do. A, a rhinoceros can do things where the elephant can do. Exactly. Yeah. So just because we say something is higher or something is more advanced, it don't mean say is this negative thing where I say about. I'm not the talking about it negative. Don't mean, say, it don't have positive qualities. No, I'm not talking about negative. I'm not talking about negative. I'm talking about. Yeah, but we, to we, it seem like no, 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 seem like man. We are talking about human beings. Take it up and you know, like when the Bible say, and man must have dominion over all the animal them. Yeah. That means say uh, what they must say is that man must now have dominion over them. Means say no, that you mean, control them and you do. I don't accept that. I don't accept true, that. Yeah. Why you want to have dominion over creatures when you don't want nobody have dominion over you? It's the same thinking. Like a man kill a cow. People say the cow make for eat. It's, it's foolishness because if cow. No, I don't subscribe to that. No, me know about the cow. The cow have a fear in him, just like the human being. When you hold the gun on the cow, I take the machine to go chop the cow. It's the same feeling the cow have. The, you have. Of course. When a man hold that pan you, so because but the cow. Taking in an animal and showing love to an animal, that is a different. Different, thing yes. Than, than killing an killing animal. animal. So may I say now the love, the love we are talking about. There is there is a certain thing that is one in the animal that is in human being and that is the life mm -hmm. and the life is what me are talking about now say if you move where the cow flesh and you move where the human being flesh is one life it do have no yeah, thought it do have no thinking that's oversimplifying it because yeah of course it's simple. Is, it's simple because it's simple. we don't necessarily develop the faculties to see the higher levels of the life of the animal it, it do it don't give we a license to, to talk definitively about what the life is and just say it's the same life. It's, it's one like, life. It's, it's one like life. If, if somebody if somebody never have the sight to see how how like if somebody was blind, them can't tell you say an animal is the same thing as a human just because the two of them can walk or they, they, they're different. No, me not understand that. Me not understand the logic. Say, no, I don't understand the logic. Say, because what? if a blind man, if a blind man can't tell you say what, what a blind man can't tell you say. If a blind man, yes, a blind man might say a human being, and maybe if if them if them if them can't get into contact with it, mm. see, and the human being maybe not talking or whatever, and there's another type of animal that can stand up on the two feet or whatever. The blind man might tell you say it's the same thing. Yes. See. Yeah, but in blind. Yeah, so what? Exactly. And so what, what is what the I'm example? Is we, a lot of us, majority of human beings, are blind to the astral bodies, the mental bodies, all of these kind of things. So we can't see them. So we we assume they don't exist, and we assume it all. No, one same life but you are assuming. No, but you are assuming no, says a different life. Different levels to the life. No, but you are. Of course, there's different levels to the life because it's in our flesh. The reason why yes, the difference in other life is because it's not the flesh. Past the flesh point, there. No, no, no. You can't well pass the flesh point. Everybody will. You see, most people will pass the flesh point, you know, because that is what we were structured to think. Mm -hmm. We were structured to think that after this life, there's a better life. Because people say, well, I'm gone to a better place. Oh, the hell you know, say somebody gone to a better place and I'm dead. When I see somebody dead, I, to me, the living. I know she said gone to a better place, but you are saying gone to a better place because you want to feel good in yourself as a living person. No, no, Muta. You, you, you're reasoning like as if I'm just talking like I'm reading. No, not you. I'm no, not you. Not, not you personally. I'm not you. I'm not blindly talking about heaven like it's just something I read. No, I'm saying that when people talk about something gone to a better place, in other words... I never say anything about nobody gone to a better you place. Man, no, you no. don't go anywhere. You're still here. 
No, yes, I'm talking about here. when you're dead. On this planet. No, when you're yes, dead. you're still on the planet when you die, you know. But you're just in a different density. Your soul exists in a different density, so you can't see it or feel it or touch it. Just like we can't, we can't touch the, the sun's rays, you know, but we know they exist. We're a part. We can't we, touch them because yeah, it's on a higher density. We're a part company. We're a part company is, is when you say that I, who dead, gone upon a higher density and have to live a certain way because I did do good over this or I did do bad this or that means you know life is going to separate itself so you don't think there should be consequences for the things that you do in life you should just be able to do whatever you want and just do good and do bad and then nothing happens but there that. is consequences if you do good and bad per earth yeah, I don't what if you, you, you feel all those consequences equate to, to what you did all the time in every human being Look here, if a man dead, that is it. If so a man death dead, is the resolving of all things. Yes, 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 yes. Well, yes. I can't think that otherwise. Make sense to me, Muta, no, because it don't make sense. The same good person, because we want to believe like the different. Bad person, so we might as well do bad. No, because you know there's consequence. No, because we might as well do bad. No, because there's a consequence in life if you do bad. No, but what if you do? So what if that everybody, is death. everybody experience them consequences? Eh? No, that is death. So death catch up on you, whether you're good or you're bad. Death catch up on you. Okay. So so it don't make sense. You, you might as well do bad. No, no, might as well you do bad because you have a consequence if you do bad here. Yes, and that's death. No. I mean, like, you're going to go to court and I'm going to judge you. And you might go to prison. No, but you I, know what? You can get away with it. Look how much of course. Can, and I'm saying, if you get away with it, which is dear, so I'm going to part company from most people who think this way. If you get away with it, and you're dead, and you don't get in, in life, yeah. it's that. It's those. It's also. That is it. Oh, so you're, you're clear. You're clear after that. That is, is, you're not clear. You're dead. Oh, you mean clear. You're not clear. You're dead. <laughs> you're not clear. <laughs> That's why I'm asking you. Keep asking you know. If I, if if I, if I, if I, if I call do this and I call do that, when the call dead, what is the consequence when when I face when I'm dead? There's no consequence. I'm dead. If a man so if, if a man kill a million, if it, if, if Hitler, if Hitler, yeah, that's what I say. If Hitler, if Hitler kill six million people, bear upon the people who kill them. No, all with the, the if six all these animals, them go bear all that karma and have to deal with it. That is where we hear. That is where we hear. If six, yeah, if and Hitler, everything what you say is what you hear too. No, no. Yes, no, I don't hear that. Look here, you know, most talking, people. So I bet you most people. I most bet you most people do agree with me. I bet yeah, you most people hear me talk about. Yes, yes, most people. No, most people agree with what you say because if you look on all of the religion, them that is how them perceive it. Yeah, but if you look on Buddhism, Kemet, if you are going to come back and live. Your next life. Right, that is most pass, religion when thinking. When people pass with certain disabilities and them things there. I think them doing at them past life, you know. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. Buddhism so believes that. It's just unfair. It's just unfair. No, life look is just here. an unfair thing. Buddhism will tell you that. I have Buddhist friend who will tell you, say, the reason why black people have got through all of this now is because we're black people that do for a long time. And that may assure you, say, them, them believe that. The reason why black people go in slavery we have to check what black people was doing. So why you don't you show me you now say it's not because white people wicked, but it's because we didn't do something in our past existence why we have got through this sufferation. I don't accept that. Yeah, but whatever white people do, I they might face it back. No, but me talk about no, yeah, so I now gonna know if I'm gonna face it back. I talk about no, I say black people never got in a slavery because they was wicked. That is why I said to you. I don't necessarily subscribe to that. Yeah, but is that, is that the Buddhist thing? I'm talking tell you? individually. I'm saying somebody who born with certain certain disabilities and then thing. Then. No, I are talking about karma. Karma we are talking about. Karma we are talking about. Yes. Karma is not sometimes... Sometime. Group, group karma and race karma is a completely different conversation. What I is a different conversation? What a conversation? What a conversation? I can talk about individual karma because I have read about that. No, I'm not talking about what you read. I'm not telling you say, so what you, else are we going to talk about? When you hear about Buddhist thing and there's no read, you read it or somebody Yeah, but I, what I tell you now, say, I never read what I tell you. 
So what, wait, what I don't you know read what I tell you. It just come to you. It yes, yes, you. yes, yes, yes. Okay. When I look on, just like how you look on where you read and say, why this make more sense to me? When I go in on my head, head cup and I say, but this make more sense to me. Because yeah, now... you're just referencing the Buddhist and Yeah, Africa. because you just refer to something where Buddhists believe in now. Karma. Okay. Them believe, say, if you, if you do something today, why somebody foot bend up, it's because they do something in their past life. I don't and believe that. You just said that people go face them consequences in this life. And if them don't They're not dead, him dead. That's yeah. karma. Wait, no, it's karma. No. Karma is just consequences for your actions. You know? No, but you are saying... Even if, if if him don't go to prison and him just dead from a cer certain sickness, so yes, he might go pay the consequence. When him dead, he might go come back and pay the consequence. Yes, sir, but I don't believe that. that. That's all I'm saying. But I assure you, say, I don't believe that. I don't believe that. Most people I, I, believe I that. I understand that you don't believe. It, Most people believe what I say. Sense. Most because people. I don't feel death is a punishment. I don't. I death don't feel death. Everybody, I forgot to. But I don't feel it's a punishment neither. If you had said no, because him never get tried in this life, he must go come back in our next life and feel the karma there. So you're saying that some people just don't get punished or karma don't apply to punishment? Yes, of course, because it's not a punishment life. Life is not a punishment thing. No, it's not it's a man punishment. Punish people. It's just consequences All right. of action. If a, man, if a man born with one foot, I don't believe that because in his past life, him did do something. So what so caused it? Just random. No, it's biological thing. Something genes and you know, biological thing. It's just that. And why that happened to him and not somebody else? Then you know, I'm talking only for people to bridge in. What, what, why? I must tell you why. I have to go be yeah, a doctor. You, you, telling me, you know how I. You know how I. You know. You know why I have to know why. You know why I have to know why. You have to study him scientifically, in terms of him biology, him DNA. What is the the, the, the the process in our body, not in spirit, in our body, that causes yes, him food to burn that way? I'm born with it, you know, it's not something I'm developed by doing certain actions. You know, no, but it comes from, from some... some it was put in place for the man to burn with that. It burn with it because... It burn with, with it because someone in his family have something, some defect in him, in him physical body that causes him to burn that way. Maybe maybe all the mother maybe I mother lie down with all them brother and maybe him maybe sister asking. lie with him cousin. I am asking you. Yes. Why it would happen to so and so and not so and so? I is, don't know if I did if I did study biology and the chemical of no, the no, human no, being. Talking about the, the biological how of, of how it happened. You know? I'm talking why it happened to that person. But why it happened is because of biological idea. Biological. Why it happened? It's not because of some karma when in a past life. I don't believe that. Most people believe that. That's what I'm telling you. Most people believe that. Most people so believe that. Basically, say, you don't believe that there is really a why. To, to, to existence and why that, things happen. Of course, that's not just, just the no, why, it, it's, it's just the science. It, of course, yes, yes. Uh, you know something, I can tell you something. I have friend when me and them sit down and them say, you know, say, all the day you talk about African and slavery and them thing. How come black people go through all of this? They know more something about karma. Just say that they talk about it, you know, them say something about karma cause it. No, if, I, if, if, if that is the case, then you have to follow it, go right through. Why a man born with one foot? Maybe it's in karma. That is, where the, that is the reasoning, you know. That everything bad happened to you in this life is because something you did do in the, next, in the life before. Mm -hmm. I don't believe that, Virgin. I don't believe that. Well, you must come with some other reasoning why it happened. Why, why slavery happened? Slavery happened because... Well, I, 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 well, you can answer that, but I'm talking about why the, the defect would happen to the person. Why the defect was up, it happened, you have to go now, go study, what is it? Just like how people, some people have relative who sleep with the next relative and nothing do happen to them, and the next person have relative sleep with the relative, and the picnic come out a certain way. Mm -hmm. There is certain biological thing that is happening that is causing yes, that. but sometimes people have three picnic were born normal and just have one and it's the same biology at play yeah but there's why? something yeah because the third one something biological is happening there 
something biological is happening to the youth and to the, 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 the okay. yeah, you know, something. It can't be nothing. And I am saying there's a reason why that happened. But the it's reason, not about the biology. No, it's, but the reason is scientific. The reason to me is scientific. That is what I say. Okay. The reason why one picnic barn good and the other picnic I kill people. Environment, family structure, mash down. The other one, family never mash mash down. A whole heap of things. No, but we're talking one, but about the same family who have three normal picnic. picnic. Yes, and under one, the same and one, but you don't and know. Not, not no, but you don't and know if it's just, no, you picnic. don't know if it's not not change. You don't know that. You don't know. You don't know if the two picnic them were dead born and the other one something never did that happening and the sexual whatsoever them did that do or whatsoever them did that eat or whatsoever. You don't know that. But I say I am carrying it to science. Science I carry it to. Right. That is why I carry it to. I now carry it to in the farm of life after that third picnic. Something did happen with that person. That's why I'm coming along. So I don't that, that I don't give credence to that. And I am telling you that most people accept that thing. Well, that's a that's a very oh your yeah. reasoning about it. It's a very European way of looking at it. Okay. A scientific kind of materialistic way. But it is material. Your flesh is material. Yeah. And you're connected and biologically. Is what come with. You come. You come biologically. Come with materialism in you know, the Greek. The Greek civilization. I don't break everything know. Everything down to the atom and tell you there's nothing more than the physical. I I, I, I never tell you said. This. Look here. It's I never like saying the Big Bang is because of. I never tell you said there's only physical and, 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 and gases coming together. Why them come together? But I never. T- but I never tell you said it's only physical. You know. I never tell you nothing is only physical. You know. No, I want to say causes, causes. I never tell you mm-hmm. it's only physical things happen. I, 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 no, I am but giving credence to life. All causes come from spirit, motor. All causes come from spirit. Yeah, everything, I don't agree with that. Everything causes. I don't agree physical with that. Physical things can't cause. You know who agree with that? Maybe my wife will agree with you. My wife will agree with you. She's a very wise person. Me know. I'm very wise. That's why I love her. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I love us. We balance all that. We balance all that. You understand? But you are though, you mash up my program totally, you know, with one song, you know. We gone past 12. We don't even give the advertisement them. We, 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 we know so it's not going to reach to this still, you know. <laughs> we know it's not going to reach to this still because. You know why we know it's not going to reach to this? Yeah, you know why we know it's not going to reach to this? For me, here you stop and I say, why you have to go revisit the Bible you now? I say, okay. <laughs> Gone so again now. Here we go again. You know, but <laughs> all of them thing that is is regurgitated well, up the same philosophy. Is, no, Bible, no, no, you are no. Everything we got, everything we got. The Bible me. have certain symbolic truths in it, but I never say no. Not something to be taken literally. You see, Kemetic. You see, Kemetic. These people that believe in a certain things. Because they believe yeah, even, certain things. Even mummy, the mummification. It, it don't them work. Did believe, say, them did believe, say, as long as the physical body don't disintegrate, yes. then you can't reincarnate. You feel, say, you, you feel, the bodies. Yeah, so you can't tell them, say, nothing never goes so? Well, I don't really believe, say, anything goes so. I don't, I, mm. I think that is something that, in that you know, time, you as, couldn't as tell we, them as so. We, as, we, as we progress along evolution, we, we learn that that not necessarily goes so. But at yeah. that stage, it not goes in, so. a, in a the pharaonic stage, that's what people believe at the time. Yeah, that's why, that's all them believe about the, the, under, the, and the nether world and the underworld and the other life and all these things. That's why they yeah. believe it. You know, and then no man will tell you say, the world flat, and then no man will tell you say, woman live on the moon. I dig it out. That's why you have environmental pollution and all these things. The, uh, Mulca, the thing about the thing, you see what them call heaven, is really is a is a world that is made up of thought and mental matter. Heaven is a state so, of so, mind. Exactly, it's literally though, you know, like you know, literal. Heaven is a state of way, mind, but literally because every like thoughts are actual forms. They're entities, but we can't see them. People who have them consciousness raised to that level can see them. People who who drop flesh and experience heaven, you know, they actually create a mental world based on their beliefs, you know, and yeah. all of those beliefs, yeah. but millions of people come together and feed into each other, you know. Yeah, so you know the problem with this? You know the problem with this? You have people who experience a heaven with Jesus and all of these things, you know. Of course, you can't experience heaven with anything. You can't experience heaven with anything, man. 
You yeah, can't believe them. Believe, them. Them believe it. Yeah, man. I, fear is the substance of things yeah, over far and the fear, evidence of things not seen. The temporary is not a real thing. Yeah, what when I say no, you're, you're, you're the problem with that reasoning, you know. Me and you, now go prove where we are say whether you right or me wrong or me right or you wrong. We now go prove it. It can't be proven. Yeah, and I think, that is, the, I think that is the difference between somebody who willing to learn and somebody who write off information. Somebody who... When well, you say write off information, what do you mean? No, the way you say write off information, what do you mean? And from your, from your that kind of mentality, it's like you lock yourself... No, off, Bri- Bridging, uh, Bridging, and... don't say that. Don't say I that. I think so. That's just my philosophy. About me? It no must go so, but that's what I believe. You because mean believe to me, towards me? With, with the, when, it, it, when it come down to, like, me are settings where I believe makes sense. And because I can't prove it to them right now, them not take nothing when me are say. No, but you are alright. No if I did have that mentality in school, yeah. no, I, I, all right, you know the difference now. I can tell you the difference now. You see what you are say? What you are say? Is when me did think when me was your age. Yeah. When me, when you are say, I'm go in a bush, come on some rasta man, and when me realize certain thing experiential not not reading it but experiencing it me realize that uh, experience teach me more better than 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 reading the thing because yeah, when we don't read lab sam rampa i'm gonna read this i'm gonna read all the yogi them and all the buddhist this information and read the bible from genesis 1 to revelation 22 in a 12 tribe and when we do all of them something there it come right round back to the, the bush rasta when not the bush. Yeah, but most and I it, think it, it never read no book. Things that I'm saying, and yeah. it's like so it's not that we don't. Why may I say to you? With everybody no, why may I say to you, like you, like you, like you, you is that what you say is not something where me never explore. If you do it, my soul like me not explore it. It's not something where me never explore. But when me did in my earlier age me I explore all of these things so it's not like say, me I lick what you are saying and I said don't worry I say and all them something there me I say me did explore them Be- before me reach where me get now I don't reach a stage where I stop exploring them no me not stop explore me not stop explore but I don't see the contrary if, if you're going to come back to me with something where me did done explore already yeah. Me want to see something now. I want to hear something. I want to experience something where it never explodes. Because I will give up all Rasta if me comes to say a foolishness. May I tell you that? No, but everything Publicly. I read, it does fulfill everything I learn about Rasta. Yeah, it's well, not contrary to anything I learn about Rasta. Yeah, I think, well, I well think me never hear Rasta talk about my afterlife. Based on, based on things that different people might say and you might feel it's very contrary to everything but I do anything with everything I don't have no problem with no religion every one of them have truth tonight I have a problem with Christianity I have a problem with Christianity I have a problem with Christianity because most of the things them and the problem we are going through here right now is because of this Christian thinking it will make we reach a certain level that we get so docile in our consciousness. We think so we have to move, faith can move mountain and not bulldozer. That is how it goes. I mean, faith say you have to have bulldozer to move it. I mean, your man can but you can stand up and take your, your mind and build pyramid. And he want me going at that with him now. <laughs> you know, man want to say you can look and you can say lightning and lightning flash. And because he do it two times or three times already, and he flash and say, see, they may not tell you, so we can do it, man. You know, them look away there. No, I mean, you know, me with them ones. Them no, me just assure yourself. No, me just assure you how the, the, the consciousness go. After you don't read all that, like Lab Sam Rampa. After Lab Sam Rampa don't write all of them things, and them go amongst the, the Indian, them and the Sadhus, them and all them people, there, you know. Him come back yeah. and come back right back to him in my life. And I say, boy, right now, instead of the mountain, him go to the mountain, the mountain come to him. Yeah. You know, because the man had climbed the mountain enough to see where up on the other side of the mountain. And all when him go over there, all him could have seen the next side of the mountain. You know, so there comes a time when you have to explore and go through all of these thinking, go through all light. 
and almost. Yeah, but it's be, for me, it's, them things are always coming and selected. So it I'm is good to do what you're doing. It is good to do what you're doing. Yeah, it, it is good. I feel like every time I go around in a cycle, it's like my overs things on a higher octave. So even yeah. I, I reach a point where I burn God and Jesus and everything, everything. Yeah. And it's like I reach a stage now where I say, all right, I come back around and I say, I, I don't identify as a Christian, but I, I see sir, a higher level of knowledge within this, these works and this philosophy. And that's when I come to things like theosophy. And even certain Rosicrucian texts and certain things yeah, like that. Yeah, all of them things there. I have a book. God was a Rosicrucianist one time, you know. You know, so uh, God was wait. a Rosicrucianist one time. Say that again? God. God was a Rosicrucianist one time. Yeah. Well, I, I have certain Rosicrucian books that yeah. even Rosicrucian them don't know about. Me have the Lawrence but book I know too. Rosicrucian people, and when I tell them about certain books where I read, they never hear about that. And me have, certain, me have a book named The Mystical Interpretation of Christmas, The Mystical Interpretation of Easter. Yeah. We're telling you about Christ as a different spirit where come and inhabited Jesus' body. And now that spirit is dwelling within the earth yeah. as the aura of the earth right now. Yeah. And you get Christian, them thing if you read, and them tell you some foolishness. Because them thing is giving you a literal what is really happening. Yeah, but maybe it's foolish. But maybe it's foolishness. But maybe it's foolishness. But maybe it's foolishness. Maybe it's a man that think deep in at some foolishness and come up with a consciousness. Of course, it could be anything yeah. is possible. What yeah. I'm saying is, I'm not coming with any kind of any kind of Christian reasoning. No, 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 no. no me never call you no Christian. No, no, Kaba, I mean, I call you Christian, man. Where are you, man? Me not say you're Christian, man. No, me not. Me say the reasoning. Me just I say the reasoning. It's like what I tell you about the, 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 the karma thing we are talking about. I tell you, say, trust me. Maybe I'll when I hang up the phone, I know if you go and listen and I take some call, you ever hear them. Most people accept what you say. Me I tell you that. Most that's people. Where I disagree. Eh? And I don't, if that is the case, then great. Most but people what, agree with what, what you're saying. talking about in terms of reincarnation and them thing there. Yeah. Most people not believe in that. Wow, reincarnation? Where you say, man? Where you say, most people? Where you say? Who are you doing? You're doing some so reggae artists when I sing, you know, when I ta- check things, you know. But, uh, most people in Jamaica don't depend on that. The average Christian. No, me, they're not calling it. All right. You know what I'm saying? That's say? not a part of Christian philosophy. No, it's not a part of Christian philosophy. But it's a exactly. part of Christian philosophy. Because it's not necessarily a part of Rasta philosophy. No, no, but it's part of Christian philosophy. You know why? Because Jesus is going to come back again. Of that course, is real. That's then that's a reincarnation. That's, that's a that's reincarnation. That's what I always tell them. Though. And a not reincar- only that, um, even thing that um, Elijah is John the Baptist, you know, and Christ tell you, you know. That's what they say in the book. Yeah, that's what they say in the book. Yeah. So you believe that? It's not about whether I believe that. I am just showing you that the people who write that, they yeah. believe that. Yeah. So the same people who are reading it now who don't believe. Yeah. They need to look at them book and see it. Say, reincarnation exists? Yeah. No, reincarnation must exist because it's in the book. I am not saying that in a motor. No, you are saying the people them believe it. I am not it. saying that it exists because it's in the Bible. No, I, I know that. that it exists yeah. because it's a logical thing and it makes sense. And <laughs> I'm saying experience where I never thought about on the ear. Where I can reason about you in person. Uh, uh, yeah, so it's where logical. I it's logical. Reincarnation to the Buddhists is a very logical thing. Of course. Yes, very logical thing. For me, there anybody who... You ever hear Bonnie Willa sing like Reincarnated Souls? Black Art Man album. Go back, go listen to that album there. Black yeah. Art Man album, Reincarnated Souls. You say, we are the Reincarnated Souls. You never hear him say, I am Moses. And yeah. them still there. Because man is steeped in the Bible, them sing them something there. I am Moses, I am this, I am that. All right. You have some man, where we look at him and say, I still say, I yeah, but Muta, that is a, that is the same thing like a man telling you say lightning, he must say lightning and lightning I got flash. That that is how I look on them mm-hmm. kind of thing. That, that that's somebody who don't really understand reincarnation. Like somebody like his majesty yeah. in fulfill the the whole human purpose. What is that the is, human that is purpose? Them final incarnation. What that's is what, what is, is his majesty? Whom is incarnate of? Who him inca- reincarnate of? Who, who, who is reincarnate of? In other I words, I don't know. I don't know in previous life. Okay, okay. 
But I can tell you that what even the Indian guru will look upon him and say he's a Mahatma, you know, that means he's a great soul, you know. Yeah. Like to him, he don't even know his majesty, but him look upon him aura and him see say, Okay, this man they on him is probably him last incarnation in the physical form. That is how most African kings were supposed to be. They're supposed find to be out, a find spiritually out, highly evolved person who can find out which part the ma- find out which part of Indian they know that they are from. The Indian you can see it on YouTube, man. No, no, me, me, Virgin, me see it, man. You know, I say, me see it. Me say, find out. Yeah, I mean, I, I which said, part man, of no, the Indian. these things are true in Amuta. Let me just tell you. No, it's I, true. I it's true. Your talk. It's true. Your talk. The man said. No, the man said. It come to me in a vision or, or something. No, no, like. no, why you say that? Things come to me in a vision, but if it makes sense to me, no, but me actually say the man, man the, the man, man no more sense, and then me don't use it. The man, what the man say, it's true that the man said. Yeah. Because in a in a in a great man of color. Um, J. J. Rogers say when him don't talk, him say one could say be old the perfect man. Yeah. Yeah. So we have to find out. So that is why I say all of these things. It's like when I start to read certain Rosicrucian texts, I realize that how His Majesty speaks is like a man who studied the same thing. Then. Well, maybe I just like he's a Freemason, you know. Yeah, and I, 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 I'm sure him go to every initiation in every kind of society, just like all the same Yeshua, Christ. Him go in a, him go in a Egypt and was initiated. That is that what is them the, say. The, 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 the between age, what is it? 12, 12. And, and 30. Yeah. It's initiation, the man got through. Yeah, that and is what them say. There as well that is what them say. Thing, so. Yes. That is what them say. You see? Is that me assure you, say all of these things. Is what them say. But, but what else are we going to do? We are going to not talk about things. No, because, no, me I say, it's what, look at, you see, you can make the thing, you can take the thing and make it become you, you know. Me I say, you see how you see experience experience trump all books all this and all that you know experience that is what me are talking about not where you believe not where you think can be or you should know, be I, I read a book on 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 on, on self-initiation and the author of the book like he's telling you about how to set up how to set up things and go through the process of initiation by yourself. And then say, there is no, like any secret society who don't want to share information, then is wrong. Yeah. Information must always be shared, but your personal experience, you shouldn't mm. share it with anybody. That's why... That the, is a philosophy. That is a philosophy that I have. That's because why the everybody Buddhist... Everybody needs to experience certain things for themselves. So I now go tell certain people my experiences. No, that's why the guru... In teaching you, him don't show your book. You see? Yeah, if you if you have a guru, if you have access to a guru, if a guru see that you are worthy to be his pupil, yeah. you don't need no book. But yeah. most of we know we don't have access when are living in India where you just walk down the road and you probably see a guru. That is what, in the West, so we work with books. That's yeah. West and I don't say most like work with books, you know. I don't say most yeah. work with books, you know. Because yeah. all of we work with books. Of course. But I, I tell no you, problem working with books. But I tell you the greatest thing is the experience. No, for sure. That is and what, what I'm saying is read I all the books. I reasoning about things. I know say I have I suppose to have more you books than you. Something you should tell the person say them have to experience it. Because I don't think everybody needs for sure them experience. No, I, I am seeing that. I am seeing that. When you put out the idea from a book, right? And I ask, and somebody come like a guru in a some bush, yeah. And I show you our experience. Well, I mean, which one trump which one? No, but a guru can show your experience, you know. A guru can tell no, you. The no, no, no. When we say you're out in the bush and you got experience, they're not sure. Show 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 they're not sure. 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 They're not I'm telling you, go down in that hole there. You, you don't have to believe it. I'm saying, go down in that no, hole there and watch it happen. You don't believe, say, do what him tell you, something has mm. to happen. And you have to believe that. No, you don't. You're not going to do it. If you don't believe it, you're not going to listen to what I'm saying. Listen to me, I say. If the guru tell you something, that is where he might tell you if you do. But you see, when you do it, you experience it. 
and what I am saying. So if 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 I tell you, you something, know, if, if you are, the, the, the guru tell you to do something for a reason, right? Yes. Because him say it are gonna lead to something, and you have to believe. Mm, no, him not. No, 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 no. You ever read? You ever read Confucius? You ever read books by of Confucius? Course. All right. When you read Confucius and all them things there, the Tao and all them something there, right? When you read them, the man tell you, say, lay down there, so. In your mind, you wonder why, you know, but you're not questioning, you're laid down there, so, because you're a guru. And this, the, 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 the most unexpected thing happened. And when you get up, him say, yeah, but why you lay down there, so, to me tell you. You know, it's like them little thing there. Yeah. That may talk about experience. Say, the guru say, lay down there, so, and you go lay down there. Mm-hmm. And him say, because you expect something to happen when you lay down there. And then him say, all right, get up. And you mm-hmm. get up. And you wonder, and him just will start walk with you now. And then you go, why, why, why you tell me that? And he say, what do you mean why I tell you that? I just tell you that. I feel for tell you that, so. And that is it. Yeah. You ever hear the story about the, 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 the the two, the two sage them that walk across the, 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 the river, and when them walk across the water, them see a woman a try cross. And mm-hmm. enough of them thinking religion, it say you must touch woman. Mm-hmm. Right? So them a walk across, and the woman walk across. And one of the sage them go across the water and lift up the woman and carry her go across the river and put her down upon the ground. And the two mm-hmm. sage them a walk, and the one will never pick up the woman and say, hey, tell me something. How comes our religion tell we say we not to touch woman? I go touch the woman. The other say look at the man say look here. I left the woman at the river miles away and you still a carrier. Hmm. All right. So what may I say to you now that the guru will just tell you say why right now? Go sit down there so, mm-hmm. and you go sit down there. And when you get up back, he asks you why you go sit down there. And that are the lesson. Yeah. So it's the them little nuances me are talk about. Where the experience might sound weird and ridiculous because it is not something when sit down and a teacher. And I say, mm-hmm. boy, all right now. All right, this, that, was that. Just like when you talk, it's, it's, yeah. it's like teaching. See? It's more... Watch out, take the food, go plant some food, man. Oh, you know, sir, when you chop bamboo in a, in a moonlight, it's got worm up and all them. Say. It's experience show you that. Yeah, experience but I, show you, say, if you, if you, I if can you tell you, I can tell you, even reading about initiation, see? Yeah. One of the things where you have to do to develop the higher faculties of, of you know, like astral vision and all of these things, you have to go out every day every morning and observe a plant growing you know and, and you do that you, you do you, that you do that after a while you have to start visualize that in your mind you know? and you, you do that may i ask if you do that you do that i have done it for a certain amount of time but i'm not consistent with it okay it's, it's, it's something where you I'm have to plant food and anything that no i'm not about the plant and have food i'm not about something where you say no, me I say. Yeah, might sound very religious. Or, or no, yeah, I say one of the things them. Yeah, say yeah, one of the things them that you supposed to do is go out and do this and do that and do that. Mm-hmm. Then the next time you go tell me no, say because you read it. That's why I ask if you do it, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Of so course. you'll do it. Yeah, I've done it, but as I say, I'm not consistent with it because I'm always supposed to do every day. And what will happen? Them say after a while, you will you, you're supposed to after observing it, mm. you're supposed to visualize it every time before you go to bed and when you wake up in the morning. And but those what? are the times when you you're kind of halfway in between the spiritual and the, and the physical. Body. And then where we are. So then what then is the best time when you can start to develop them things there. So you you start to you start to you, you start to develop the mental ability to to picture the process of growth. Right, let me and tell then you, 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 dip, you picture the process of decay as well, and them thing that after a while, after yeah. time, you're supposed to have a shift in your process where you. You save me that the knowledge, the bridge. You save me that the knowledge there. Eh? Would I do it? Because would I want experience that? Yes. 
No, but that the whole thing, all right. Wait there, wait there. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you something. You know, say, you know, profile? Yes. All right, profile and whole heap away in some bush. And the whole away, locks, the whole away are eat like that, and the whole away are now walk with no shoes, yeah. barefoot. Right? And we continue on the journey, continue on the journey. All right, the whole away come out of the bush now. All right, me, me not tell nobody say me stop wearing shoes, you know, but most people never see me in our shoes. Yeah. So for them arguments is though that most of them wear shoes, and if him see me put on a shoes, I'm going to say, Ross, you see me put on a shoes. All right, look here now. Your thing, say, is an easy thing to go around the world for 40 years. And that's how your shoes, my Jane. <laughs> eh? No, no, it is. All right, and that may I show you now, say, me did have experience that. Of course. I'm tell Tony Rebel, say, Rebel, me and you got the three most important places in our thinking, Ethiopia, um, where we go, Ethiopia, Israel, and some other place to go, where we are say, I guess we did one go, go experience that. All right. Yeah. You say, watch on, it's when me don't experience that. If you see me in our shoes, don't feel the way. I told Rebel, say, I'm going to buy your shoes. I told Tony Rebel, don't buy your shoes. Because him don't feel say I'm gonna put it on him feel say him gonna go against my consciousness if him really buy a shoes to me. But him say I'm gonna do it still, you know. All right. What me I said to you is that people see me walk a foreign in a the snow. And I say, this no real. <laughs> and people see me walk on the street down here when the thing hot. The other day when me a march, we are march with the cockpit country. Everybody I want to say, I don't know you do it, you know, you do it. All right. You see, to that now, that in a certain so-called spiritual realms, you know, a man I was sure, you know, say, why, you know, you have to go through certain this and go through certain that. I said, no, but when we did stop, we will take off the shoes. It's not that we did that thing, man. It's a liberty child. We did that child. Of course. Yeah, it's a liberty child. It's not, no. Ex, what them call it experiment and all them something there and up to this day may I tell you my daughter almost so 40 at the old and I don't think she remember my daughter yeah 40 I don't know if my daughter remember seeing me in her shoes <laughs> and it's that I'm going to put on one you know may I tell you that you know it's not that I'm going to put yeah. on her shoes because I'm no madman sure. if me feel say the fire hot out the stuff I'm going to put on something to protect my foot yeah, natural. Yes. Yeah. So when me I say is that practicality, me I talk about with the experience. The experience. Not something where you read, not something where you think, but I mean not not where you think. So it's not where you read or something where yeah. you, somebody else say. But me grew up on some man with can't read in Rasta. Mm -hmm. Them can't read. And for them level of Rastafari is when me all happen, not Pep tribe. No, me, of course. Me, I ones like me never hold on from 12 tribe because 12 tribe never did that experience Rastafari. Yeah. They might read the Bible and I quote the Bible and I put the Bible in a perspective and context and all them something there. But the experience where me I search for in a Rastafari, me never see it amongst the 12 tribe. Me did have to go in a some bush with Ivy and Profi and all of it would left and go in a bush go experience that how it feel yeah. for don't live in our house and put on touch and do that and tear without food and a read we go read about about, about raw food you know I experience we go experience that True. and when we come out of bush now me I hear people that talk about vegan and lacto vegetarian and all them see the with and that see so it's just that me I say me I say it is good because I'm there in a bush and I read all of these laps and rampa book. Buddhism, Taoism, Confucius. If you come to my yard now, I can lend you some book. Where all the things where you are talking about it right now. We read about it and I say, yes, it is a good thing for read because we all use some of what I read and quote it from somebody too. But you see the experience of me are talking about, brethren, that is where grab the fullness. You know, so me not leak what you say, you know. Me not leak what you say, you know. Me just put another conversation to you. I try to reading with the experience. Me just put the conversation to you. It's just a conversation where you, 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 you make up my program tonight. 
because I don't play the advertisement them. I'm a, me deliberately go there, so you know. Me, you know why I deliberately go there. You know why I deliberately go there, so. You know, say so it never turn out to this, don't it? No, man. <laughs> you know, so. <laughs> and that's oh, why I love you, yeah, know, because yeah, know. every time that you talk, well, you see, yeah, I when we depend on the boat, we can't talk, you know. Because we depend on the boat, I, yeah. you saw with Ziggy, ba- Ziggy them and the ball and them, like, we can't even talk to you, you understand? <laughs> and when we come to Jamaica, you're dead and you're world up, you're so in the world, my ass, so we can't talk <laughs> to you. True. But we know so it never come to this. We know so it never left all the symposium and come to this, we like, deliberately bring it to that. So you must know that. Because we know you want experts that too. Well, I remember the reason for museum the time. Man. Yeah, a long time you want to bring, a long time you want to say what you're saying so no on the program, you know. No, for sure. I'm going to give you an opportunity to say it. I'm going to tell yeah, you. Yeah, man, I feel like, I feel like that at the time that when we call you, you know, say, I'm going to go in and say, Yeah, man, that, me not, me, no, but you have to, you see, no, but all you use to angle me is like, me I run from your reasoning. <laughs> it's like, no, oh, yeah. No, no, yeah, no, it's like, yeah, Oh, me yeah, not bring you up on the program yet. I mean, I say, well, all right, see? It? Oh, yeah, no, for sure, I mean, definitely. So, me bring it to you, the reason where you did one reason. Yeah, man, for sure, man. I'm glad for the opportunity. And that is an experience. Experience. <laughs> that is an experience. Anyway, you never cut my program. It's a lucky thing at night because you know, you're how much management that call me that tell me say, where is the anthem? Where is the this? Where is the that? And all them something there. So, you know. We're supposed to talk to Kadamawi you now. We can't get him. I don't know why we can't get him. Because they want to talk about the ganja in, Ras- in, in Peter Tash. The ganja in Peter Tash, but I saw it go. Anyway, yeah, Bridget, we have to move on all those. Serious? Well, give thanks, man. Yeah, man. Give thanks. Yeah. 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 You have a reggae, my love.